guys, welcome back to my channel. <sighs> I'm kind of back in my old setup here. Um, I'm turned a different direction. I haven't done anything with the background. It's just kind of piles of stuff back there, but I'm ready to step back into my office. Um, I haven't been able to do this in a while. So before we get into the uh, q and I wanted to just give you guys some answers on some other things. Um, so first of all, thank you for those of you that got involved. Uh, with the project that I had mentioned uh, maybe one or two videos ago with aboutface.org and Naya and it's also in conjunction with TEDx so if you guys are not familiar with TED um, well anyway here's my point thank you so much to those of you that did decide to get involved and help out with the cause and we are like this close to actually getting to our goal so if you wouldn't mind I would seriously appreciate it this is not um, it's not sponsored in any way, it's just a good thing to do. So I would really appreciate it if you would check it out and I will leave the link down below. You can sign up to help to be someone who is um, in support of basically body positivity, which is what aboutface.org is all about. It doesn't cost you any money or anything. And then there are some incentives. So once we get to the goal, which should be soon, hopefully if you guys uh, click the link and go through that, um, then you will unlock the incentives. So. Um, anyway, like I said, I'll put the link right down below so you can go to the Naya app and you can sign up to join the cause. Um, okay, and then <laughs> the next thing I want to talk about is the calendar. As you guys know, I had announced the SRV project uh, a couple of months ago and I told you I came out with the calendar. 16 month calendar called the Year of Inspiration. All about inspiring you guys and having this guided journey to help you through, um, you know, a, a number of different things. So every month has a different... <gasps> I should get the calendar, hang on. Okay, I just ran across the house. So, my calendars are finally printed, and as of this very moment, they have been shipped. So anyone that um, pre-ordered or ordered one, uh, they are on their way to you now. You might have it by the time I post this video, I don't know. Um, I, I'm gonna say just, uh, without getting to too much, on a personal note, I know a lot of you guys have noticed that my videos have been a lot less frequent, and that maybe my my attitude has been different um, and it's, I mean, it's true. And it's because while this project right here, while this was something that I really, really, really wanted to do, there were a lot of things on the back end of it, things that I'm never gonna talk about because it's not needed. Um, there were a lot of things that, that just caused frustration. And the frustration caused me to have a bad attitude and I'm someone who really wears my emotions on my sleeve and so I couldn't, I couldn't fake it, guys. I couldn't get on here and pretend like I was the happiest person about everything because I'm just, I wasn't. I was going through so much and it was affecting me so deeply and my emotions were just so messed up that I felt like I couldn't see the light, right? And it's nothing against the actual project because I'm still so excited about it and I'm so excited to those of you that have decided to join me on this uh, journey and I'm so excited to get the whole thing rolling which FYI uh, month one January the content's gonna be a little bit late basically because I wanted to make sure you guys actually had it I want you to be excited to join me too and it's hard to get excited about something that you never received right so now that you actually have it um, that'll roll out this week and then um, the following months will all be scheduled and the schedule is written right inside of here so um, anyway, it was just hard for me to fake it and now that I just came back from LA, which you guys will see some videos with Kendall and I from LA, um, I just feel better. I feel like I've had some closure. I feel like I've sort of talked things out and done some things that I needed to do and, and I'm feeling better now. And so I'm feeling more energized and I'm feeling more focused and I'm just feeling better. And so um, I, I would love to say hopefully the videos will be back to exactly what they were or better or more. Um, I can't guarantee it, but I can tell you that mentally and emotionally right now I'm feeling better <laughs> and I can genuinely say that I'm feeling better and maybe you can tell I don't know um, but just real quick I know it's really this is the longest intro of life but this is just a Q&A video so I mean <laughs> I'm still gonna answer questions and I, since it's my channel I get to make it as long as I want so the calendars do all come uh, shrink wrapped and so I'm gonna open one for you guys because I this is the first one that I've had that um, has no mistakes or anything in it and so there's the shrink wrap and then here is, in the center of it, it will come uh, chipboarded so that you guys can uh, not have a bent up calendar. And oh, and real quick before I forget, everything is shipped and I've fulfilled every single order that was placed and now I have to say that I can no longer offer international 
um, shipping because it costs me more to ship the calendar than what I charged you for the calendar. So um, while I would love to put this in the hands of anybody that wants it, I cannot afford to lose money every single time someone buys one. So um, I'm going to offer it in the United States still. I guess if you really want one and you're international, I would have to up the shipping price to like 20 bucks. Um, and if that's still something you're down with, great. But I don't feel good doing that. Um, that being said, I can't, I can't afford to lose money every time someone buys one. So um, I'm really, really, really sad about that. But I feel like anyone who really, really wanted it, who was international, you probably would have bought it by now, right? So <laughs> hopefully that's the case. And I have fulfilled every order and everybody that has it or everybody that ordered it and the payments went through and everything was processed and everything, then you automatically had it shipped out to you. I do not physically ship these, so if you do have a problem or you do see trackings messed up or whatever, if something's wrong, then go ahead and email me at um, Sarah, what is my email address? At SRV, <laughs> go ahead and email me at the email that I have listed right here. I can't think of it off the top of my head. Um, but uh, yeah, that's just something I wanted to mention to you. So this is what the calendar looks like. It is a full size calendar and it, you've seen the cover, I'm sure. It says a year of inspiration, Sarah Ray Vargas, and it's beautiful. And then this is the back of it. Um, it has my thank you and then it has all of the uh, months right here. So I'm not gonna show you the whole thing because that's private, guys. But here is January. I will show you January because we're in January. Um, this is the layout of it. And this is a beautiful dress. Oh, I love it so much. And it says, loving yourself becomes so easy the moment you decide to stop hating the little pieces of who you are. Every quote in here is my own. It is something that um, I came up with and it's something that I'm sharing with you guys and for January a special thanks to Gerard Cosmetics who sponsored this month uh, who they were actually a sponsor for a couple of different things in this calendar and um, shout out to them for always having my back and being a great company to work with and um, I will be having a some special content for this month that you guys will see if you bought the calendar so I'm really excited about the whole thing and I don't want to give too much away but it's just it's just it's just amazing. I am so glad it's finally done and it's 16 whole months of different stuff here. So I don't want to show it all to you because, you know, I want you to have fun when you see it yourself for the first time. If you want to buy one, you still can and you can get it at sarahraybargas.com. And um, that's all I have to say about that. So very excited about that. And now let's get into the q and I know it's like epic intro, right? I asked you guys the other day if you wanted to do a little Q&A on the Instagram, which my Instagram is uh, Sarah Ray Sarah with three H's if you are interested. And I'm gonna go ahead and go through and answer some of the questions that I have not um, you know, answered in a thousand other Q&As. So here we go. When are you gonna do more my first time videos? My first, oh, like the, the tipsy story time videos? You guys wanna see some more of those? Cause I only had like 10,000 people tell me they wanted to see more of those. Um, I could do them, but I really don't, uh, I, re I don't film that kind of stuff when I have the kids. So maybe next time I don't have the kids. Uh, what's the lowest weight you've been since you turned 20? Um, I was probably like, I would say the lowest number on the scale I've ever seen as an adult is probably 210 pounds even. Uh, I would say that's the absolute lowest I've ever seen. Um, would you rather live the rest of your life without cheese or oral sex? Without oral sex probably until I meet the guy who just throws down because so far cheese has really knocked it out of the park. Would you slash do you online date? I do not online date. I have never online dated. I've never created a profile or anything like that and I would not and that's simply because I will say right now in this moment I would not online date um, because I have a YouTube channel online that really lays out half of my damn life and tells you guys all kinds of things and I feel like I would be at such a deficit in the relationship if someone was able to just Google my name after seeing my online profile and not only do they get what I put on the profile but they also get 300 videos about my life. Like, uh, I couldn't do it personally and I think just because of the nature of, of my work, you know? so. Um, no, but I mean if I was just a, you know, if I didn't have like this kind of social following, I might online date, but people, mm, I don't know, like guys seem like assholes online, like they have no filter and 
no thank you. Plus, just no thank you in general right now. Eh. <laughs> uh, let's see. What would you consider the biggest insult to yourself? Like, what's the worst thing you could say about me? Well, you, nothing probably, because I don't know you personally, but the worst thing that a person can say about me, maybe like in person, is that I'm stupid. Like, don't call me dumb. Ah, we gotta go to therapy. Okay, um, don't call me dumb, but, uh, like, because that really offends me. Like, don't tell me I'm dumb. Like, I'm not dumb. I don't like being called stupid. Like, when people treat me like I'm stupid, like, bro, no. I'm not stupid. Maybe you don't agree with my idea, but that doesn't mean I'm stupid. I just... I don't like that. I have a really big problem with people thinking that I'm not an intelligent human being, so that would probably be the worst insult. Um, if you can instill one quality in your kids, what what is it? What would it be? Um, all kinds of stuff. Like I want my kids to be honest. I want my kids to care about people. I want them to care about themselves and have confidence, and I want them to be... Uh, very tolerant. So I live my life and try to be as tolerant as possible and as I've gotten older I've opened myself up a lot more and I feel like I will continue to do this or at least I hope that I do because I notice when people sort of hit a certain age like like I can't talk to a 35 year old man and tell him something about how he's got some sort of privilege in the world because he's want to hear it right. So I think once you reach a certain point you become a lot less tolerant and so I hope that before I get there, I can open myself up to different ideas and different people and, and, and realize that people see the world in a different way and be tolerant of that even if I don't agree with it. So tolerance is certainly something I want to teach my children because I don't want them to go through life thinking that their way is the only way and if someone is not doing something their way, then it's the wrong way because I think it's such a, it's such a, a limiting perspective and I, I would hate for them to grow up like that. Uh, someone else said, how'd you get into slash star plus size modeling? I, despite the fact that I modeled for 16, 17 months here, I am not a model. I'm not a plus size model. The reason that I get paid or the reason that I have the opportunity to model clothing sometimes or to model whatever, it's not because I'm a plus size model. It's because I have a personality online. It's because I'm a YouTuber or because I'm a blogger, not because they're hiring me to wear the clothes as a model. So you're never going to see me in an outfit and they're just going to have me on a website like this is just Sarah in the outfit. It's going to be like, this is plus size blogger Sarah Ray Vargas rocking our whatever, whatever. So I'm not a plus size model. However, <laughs> I was on the cover of Plus Model Mag this month, which was so exciting. So if you want any information about plus modeling, you should check out that magazine or check out that website. Um, so it's plusmodelmag.com, I think. If not, I will definitely leave, the, um, I'll leave it down below because they had a whole spread with my uh, picture and question, and, uh, an interview and just pictures from the calendar and stuff, little sneak peeks, stuff that no one has seen before. So uh, be sure to check that out if you have not. I'm going to answer two more questions and then i got to take my baby man to therapy. Uh, somebody else asked, are there any new men in your life? <laughs> um, and then someone said, uh, let's see. Okay, here's the last one. Would you ever consider getting back with any of your exes or is all that ancient history? If so, any current interests? Okay, that's basically the same question. Uh, no, I would not consider getting back with my exes, I don't think. Of course, if there was ever anybody in this world that I would probably get back together with, which I never foresee it happening, it would only, it would most likely be the kid's dad, but it's not something that I've even imagined doing. So, um, and the only reason I say that is because as far as my exes go, he's the only one who's going to remain in my life for a while. <laughs> Alright guys, I think I'm going to end it there. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to click the link for the Naya app so you can join the initiative here with aboutface.org. I would really personally appreciate it just as like a personal favor to your girl Sarah Ray. Um, and then if you're interested in the calendar, uh, you can get it at sarahrayvargas.com. And I'll put a coupon code or something down below. Um, again, super sorry about the international shipping thing, but I just, I just can't do it. And I wanted to be super open and transparent with you guys and let you know why. Um, and that's, I think that's all I have to say. Let me know what kind of videos you want to see. Like I said, I'm feeling, I'm just, I'm just feeling better. I don't know if you can tell, um, but I'm feeling better. Also, I tried a new foundation today and I don't know how I feel about it. It's that Kat Von D stuff. Oh, I went to IMATS and I bought a whole bunch of stuff. Maybe you want to see what I bought. I don't know. Um, but that's it. I hope that you guys are having a great day. <sighs> I think I'm going to have a great day. <laughs> so, um, I hope that you're having a great day and give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more. That's all I have to say. I hope that I see you in my next video. Bye guys.